yes, I got Taboki right here. And then I got some bok choy. I put some of the bok choy in the taboki, but I kind of like my vegetables not like mushy and overcooked. So I put some in for flavor, but I also kept like half of it out so that I could just dip it in the sauce because when it's when it when you throw it in, it just gets. I mean, it still has a. A little crisp to it, but it's like limp now. You know what I mean? And I made this sauce myself. It is a little spicy. I didn't put as much because you guys know that I mean, I have a colostomy bag, so I can't really eat too spicy stuff. This is pretty spicy compared to what I've been eating. But from like before cancer, <laughs> this ain't spicy at all. And then I put baby corn in it. And these are absolutely delicious. Oh, perfect. And then I um, bought some hand-pulled scallion pancakes. And these were actually, like, fresh. They were not cooked already and then just, like, reheated. These actually came fresh. So I will be buying these again because these are really, really good. I do need some soy sauce, though. Or I'll just dip it in this sauce, actually. But. This is my first time having taboki. And I just knew I was going to like it. Mm. I had to buy it online because, like I said, I don't have really, um, there's like an Asian shop. Like, 45 minutes away. But they don't carry, like, taboki. It's more like Vietnamese, Chinese food. They don't really have certain, like, like Korean foods and street food stuff. They don't have nothing like that. So, um, <laughs> this is my one meal a day. And then I'll have fruit tonight when I'm uh, hungry again. And then, of course, I had to put a, a, two eggs in it. Let's taste it. It is really hot, though. Mmm. Oh, yeah. I should have put more eggs in this bitch. I only put two. I should have put more. Mmm. The only thing that I am missing is green onion. I know. The video I watched, they said the more green onion, the better. 